Hi! Welcome back to my channel. Today, I have a new video. I will teach you how to create a virtual background for your Zoom or Google Meet. Plus, I have a free background or layout that you can use for your online class. A virtual background allows you to display an image or video as your background instead of whatever is naturally behind you. You can even use photographs of nicely decorated office space as your virtual background. This can be a great option for anyone with kids or small spaces. I use Microsoft PowerPoint. Start na tayo, open nyo lang yung inyong Google and then search wall with a floor background. Okay, so maraming choices dyan. So click nyo lang yung image and then right click copy, and then i-paste sa Microsoft Office. Okay, i-resize nyo lang siya. Balik tayo sa Google. Search bulletin board for classroom. Ayan, pili lang kayo ng gusto nyong color or style or design ng bulletin board. So, click copy and then paste sa PowerPoint. Resize lang natin kung ano yung gusto natin na size, pero wag masyadong malaki. Okay? So, and then, if you place the middle part. Next is, go back to Google search and then type bookshelf clip art transparent background. Then, click copy and then paste ulit natin sa Microsoft Office. So, resize lang natin siya, of course, not bigger than our bulletin board. And then, ikakopy paste ko lang siya para maging dalawa yung, para maging dalawa yung ating bookshelf. Next is go back to Google and then search for books clip art. Ayan, so this one, ito yung napili ko and then ikakopy ko lang and then paste and ilalagay ko siya sa bookshelves. Ayan, so try pa natin maghanap ng ibang design. Okay, so next, ayan, ito yung napili ko yung may bag. Okay, kakopy ko ulit and then ipipaste sa Microsoft. Okay, now as you can see, merong white background. So, this is how you remove the white background. Click picture format. And then, remove background. And then, re-resize lang natin. Okay, and then keep changes. Okay, so yan. Ipiplace na natin siya sa bookshelf. And then, maghahanap pa ako ng um, books, other design ng books. Okay, so, again, repeat the process. Picture format, remove background, and keep changes. Okay, so, for me, I think okay na itong bookshelf. Next is, mag-add tayo ng flowers. No, mag-add tayo ng flowers for design. So, ipapatong lang natin siya sa ibabaw ng shelf. Ayan. Okay, next is um, first aid kit. Ilagay tayo ng first aid kit. Search first aid kit clip art. And then, pumili lang kayo ng gusto ninyong design. Click copy image and then paste sa Microsoft and then i-resize natin. Uh, mas okay kung yung height niya is same lang sa height ng flowers. Alright, next is, so para may design yung ating bulletin board, pwede tayo mag-search na code for students. Code for students. Ayan. So, ito yung napili ko. 
Go to Day a Reader, Tomorrow a Leader. Again, click Copy Image and then Paste sa Microsoft Office. And then, i-crop lang natin siya para mas maliit yung white background. And then, i-re-resize. And then, ilagay sa loob ng bulletin board. Okay, so nilagyan ko rin siya ng black border. Next is um, calendar. Pwede tayo maglagay ng calendar. Search calendar clip art. And then choose your preferred calendar. Ayan, gusto ko to. So, ikakopy and then ipipaste ko sa Microsoft and then crop. I resize ko siya. Half lang na pinili natin na code. Okay. So, i-edit ko lang yung brightness niya. Next is um, cleaners. Ayan. Cleaners. Clip art. Okay. So, click copy and then paste. Okay, so, i-resize lang natin kasi laki ng calendar. Pwede kayong mamili kung ano yung gusto nyo ilagay sa bulletin. For example, um, announcement or birthdays or rules. Something like that. Kayo bahala basta uh, maging creative. Next, for teachers, repeat the process lang. Gayahin lang yung layout or template for students. This is how you add your virtual background. Click your Zoom app. Then set, go to settings, backgrounds, and filters. Add image. And then select your background. As I promised, I have a free layout or template for you that you can use for your virtual background. You can screenshot the layout or template and save it to your computer. Thank you very much for watching our tutorial. I hope that you learned how to create a virtual background for Zoom and Google Meet.